It's sat on the old train bridge support on Quincipi Island since the early 1970s, and now the old lighthouse beacon is dark. The Quincy Park District is aware of the light being out and is in the process of doing something about um, it. They realized that it was no longer working a little while ago and they've had a contract to look at it because it's obviously something that you don't always fix. Um, it doesn't come up a lot, so they're having to look into exactly how much it would cost. And um, once we have that information, we'll be able to make a better decision on what we'll do next step. The old lighthouse was a gift to the Park District from what was then Mormon Manufacturing Company back in the early 70s. Company employees built the lighthouse for a company promotion and after the year-long set sales for the 70s was over, the lighthouse moved from 30th and Chestnut to its current location. Well, we look, you know, we hope for it to be working very, very soon. Um, it's still a very nice piece. It's a decorative piece. People can still see it during the daytime, so it works out in that way. And then um, hopefully it'll get lit again for the evenings. So for now, the Park District is waiting on the final report from the contractor to see how much the cost will be for repair but for many, they hope the lighthouse will set sail once again with its beacon shining brightly across the Quincy Bay. Jim Whitfield, KHQA News, Quincy.